Hello and welcome to Smart Home Automation Systems. We turn your home into a smart home. Today we'll be showing you the inside of a smart home. Smart homes of the past required you to have your house all wired up, either by using your existing electrical wiring or by running communication cables. You would also have control panels on your walls, where you had to walk over and go through menus to operate everything. Today, we don't have to do this. Today, it's much simpler. You can freely walk around your house and tell it what to do. Alexa, turn living room lights off. Let me introduce okay. you to Alexa, who will be helping me out. But first, Alexa, turn on the living room lights. Okay, and there it is. A smart home would not be a smart home without the help of Alexa. Allow me to introduce her. She's very helpful. Alexa, hmm, how are you doing today? Great, ready to help. You can talk to her and ask her all kinds of questions. For instance, Alexa, what is my commute to work? The fastest route takes about 32 minutes via HW Y404 and Don Valley Parkway South. She only wakes up when you say her name, so if you don't say the key word, then she won't respond to you. Alexa, what is the temperature in Newmarket? In Newmarket, Canada, it's 3 degrees with showers. Today, you can look for snowy, rainy weather with a high of 6 degrees and a low of 0 degrees. Alexa, what's my sports update? Here is your sports update in MLB. Last night the Blue Jays lost to the Rangers, 6-5 to five in extra innings. They'll play later today at 3.05 p.m. in Arlington against the Rangers in NBA. On Friday, the Raptors lost to the Heat. 103 to 91. They'll play later today at 3.30 p.m. at home against the Heat. Alexa, what's on my calendar? Here are the next two events. On Tuesday, May 24th, at 1 p.m. there's lunch with your best friend Sarah and on Friday, May 27th, at 7.30 p.m. there's girls night out at the movies. Alexa, play my music. Shuffling music. Alexa, who is this? This is Shut Up and Dance on Talking is Hard by Walk the Moon. Alexa, turn that up! <laughs> Alexa, stop! And there you have it. She's very compliant and she'll work with you. Whenever someone rings the doorbell, I can see who it is from where I am. While watching the live video, I can ignore the call or swipe to talk the person. The good thing is that the person ringing the bell doesn't know if I'm inside the house or in a different city. When the doorbell is pressed, it takes a picture of the person and automatically saves it to my phone. I can even record the video to my phone. Calling. Wait a moment, please. Speaking of... Hello! Hi, it's me! It's so great to see you, Sarah! Come on in! Hi! <laughs> and there you have it. It's that easy. Let's talk about lighting. In order for the lighting to be controlled, these switches have been replaced with Z-Wave wireless technology lighting and switches. This is them. This is our smart hub. A smart hub knows the status, whether the lights are on or off, and can easily be controlled, no matter if you physically turn the lights off or if you actually talk to Alexa. This is the brains of the network, where it integrates multiple systems. It receives input from all the devices around the home and issues commands and controls everything. 
Alexa also communicates with this hub. Let's watch. Alexa, dim family room to 10%. Okay. Alexa, dim family room to 100%. Okay. Alexa, turn on the TV. Okay. And there you have it. It's that easy. Alexa, turn off the TV. Okay. Now I'm going to go to the kitchen. Now, as you notice, the kitchen is rather dark. I can actually manually turn on the lights from my phone. And there we have it. Alternatively, I can also get Alexa to help out. Alexa, turn on the cabinet lights. Okay. And there you have it. A great way to lighten up your day. Alexa, turn on the kitchen light. Okay shedding a little light on the subject. She can even set the temperature for you. Alexa, set the thermostat to 23 degrees. Setting thermostat heat to 23. It's that easy. You can also do it right from the palm of your hand. So as you can see, it's at 23 now. If I wanted to adjust it to 25, I would just do that. And as you can see, it is going to bring the heat. The most amazing part of having a smart home is that you don't have to carry your phone or tablet with you in your home. Your home should respond automatically when things like a motion sensor is activated or you open a door to one of your rooms. This is what makes your home a smart home. When you are home, you shouldn't have to reach into your pocket, pull out your phone and flip through your screens looking for your app. Then once you have it open, you shouldn't need to look for the light you want to turn on inside the app. That's too messy. It should be easier for you to have things automated. Now let's go upstairs. As you'll notice, when you walk up the stairs, it is going to turn back on as they're on a motion sensor. The lights will turn off after one minute for energy conservation. We have another Alexa upstairs. You're going to meet her very shortly. Our Alexa upstairs is able to assist you by playing music at night, waking you up with an alarm in the morning, and even turning on your bedroom light. Alexa, turn on the bedroom light. Okay. Thank you. Now we're going to go over to the closet where you're going to be able to see just what I mean by that motion sensor magic, taking you into the next century. And as you can see, the minute I enter, the light has come on. In the washroom, we have a heater for those cold winter nights. You can set up a routine so it turns on five minutes before your alarm goes off to ensure you walk into a nice, cozy, and warm bathroom. You can also turn it on from your bed using your phone or letting Alexa do it for you. Alexa, turn on the heater. Okay. And now this place will be nice and cozy when you get out of bed. With the smart two-in-one carbon monoxide and smoke detectors, you will get an alert on your mobile device whenever the alarm goes off. This is great in case you aren't home when it happens. Also, you can set all the lights to turn on when it goes off so you can easily see your way safely outside. We have a smart video camera installed in the foyer. Whenever motion is detected, it automatically starts recording it saves the recorded video locally and also has the option to save the images in the cloud if you wish to do so. This camera could be set up when I leave the house or at night when I'm sleeping. I could get alerts on my phone when motion is detected. And yes, these cameras are pet friendly, meaning they can't set off the motion sensor causing it to record.
Now we're going to talk about automating your garage door. This is a good feature to give you peace of mind and for added security. Have you ever worried about if you close the garage door? You can go home and check or keep worrying about it until you get home. There is a better option. Using your smartphone, you can check if your garage door is open or closed anytime from anywhere. You can even open or close it from your phone. And if you wish, you can get alerts anytime your garage door is open for added security. What I like about it is if for any reason the garage door is open for an extended amount of time, it can send you an alert on your phone. We install automatic shades which can be integrated into your smart home. Serena battery powered shades are a convenient and beautiful way to control daylight into your home. They are available in roller and honeycomb styles. The shades move smoothly and quietly in perfect unison, giving your home a unified look inside and out. They come in a variety of colors, textures, and opacity so you can complement the look of your room. Installing the D-cell batteries are easy. The head rail makes it simple by tilting forward so you have easy access. The batteries can last anywhere from three to five years depending on your usage. We hope you've enjoyed this tour of our smart home. The options are endless and can be customized to your own needs. Let us know if you have any questions about this video. Subscribe to see more videos. Visit our website at smarthomeautomationsystems.com. You can follow us on Twitter and like us on Facebook. And remember, we turn your home into a smart home.